right, guys, for your first minion project, we're going to make the shapes and learn about a little bit about color schemes. Um, so being new to Adobe Illustrator, we're, we've already set up our, our files. All right, we've already set up our, our artboards. Okay, and I'm going to make these shapes. These are the shapes that I want you to replicate. All right, we got squares, rectangles, rounded squares, rounded rectangles. All right. To do that, you are going to be in, use primarily your shape tool. All right. The first row is pretty easy. All right. We're just going to click and drag. All right. To get a square, I'm going to hold shift. Get hold shift. Rectangle. All right. What's the next one? Rounded square. If I hold down the shape, I click down, I get a bunch of other options. Rounded rectangle. Again, I'm going to hold this. Hmm, that's a bit different. That's a little bit of a tighter. The other thing, remember to copy and paste. I can copy and paste this. Command C copies. Command F will paste it on top. All right, and then I can pull these little things down, and that can round my rectangle. All right, the next one is a rounded rectangle. This was a square. All right, remember to copy and paste. Don't recreate things if you don't have to. Copy and paste. Use what you have, and then pull on those things. All right, we want to get our shapes as close as we possibly can to the shapes we're supposed to replicate. All right, again... If I can use my ellipse, I hold shift as I make my shapes. All right. Good. All right. So these shapes I've already created. All right. The next thing you guys are going to do is align these. Make sure these are aligned. If I, if these are all made and these are all in, you know, goofy alignment, you know, these are all goofy alignment, I want to get them aligned. So I can select rows and columns and up here these are my align options all the shapes are going to be aligned a certain way so if I line them on the center all those shapes will line up and then I can move those into place all right if I select all of these I can line them up into center I can select all of these line them up into center and so on and so forth this is vertical alignment now if I do horizontal alignment, I can then do uh, get all these shapes to the center of the horizontal alignment. Oh, that's distribution, sorry. All right, and I can hold shift and move those up. Horizontal alignment, hold those up, and then all those shapes are now back into alignment. All right, so that's a good thing to do. Make sure we talk about balance as one of the principles, uh, elements and principles of graphic design. Uh, make sure our, our piece is nice and balanced. Everything's aligned up as best as we can possibly get it. The next thing we're going to talk about is color schemes. You, this is black and white. It's a bit boring. So I want you to research color schemes. So, you know, I've already done. I'm looking for a fun color scheme. All right, fun color scheme. And what's nice about Illustrator is we can – just drag our file directly into our document and drop it in, okay? Now there's nothing really I could do with this except we're gonna use the eyedropper tool, all right? So I'll put this to the side, all right? Put this to the side. This is the eyedropper tool. I might select the shapes I wanna create. Let's go, I'm just gonna go kinda of like a checkerboard, every other shape. I'm holding down shift right now. I'm holding down shift right now and I'm selecting all these shapes. And I like this blue. I'm going to take the eyedropper tool. All those shapes are selected. I'm just going to suck up that color and change them to this color. Um, let's go every other one now. Balance, right? Suck up the red. All right. Maybe I want to add this one, little pop of red to, you know, make this yours. There we go. Holding down shift, suck up the red. I kind of like that. All right. I kind of like that. A 
Yeah. I actually like this a little bit better. We're going to take the red out. This looks nice. All right, so if I file, I'm going to bring my file over. And then just like to save the file, if I'm ready to turn this in. All right, this looks nice. Ready to turn it in as Mr. Z. I'm going to file, save as. All right, make sure it's an Adobe PDF. All right, save it as minion one. One. All right, save. View PDF after saving, like always. See my PDF? Oh, that looks nice. All right, I'm ready to turn it in and I submit it to Schoology. We're always going to work on the next one. All right, next one I can copy and paste. All right, call it number two. All right, and we're going to work on our next one right here. And I believe, I believe it is the text. All right, so I'm just going to put text in there. All right, we'll see you on the text.